have to be like that. It's Apoorva and welcome to my channel, my happy team. But how are we supposed to be happy when people don't work around according to us? Hmm, so what do we do? Let's just change them. But we tried a million times by asking, requesting, scolding, criticizing, taunting. We tried pretty much everything to change them. But they didn't improve a bit. So what else is left that we can use to change them? The answer lies in the difficult little thing called forgiveness. I know, letting go of things doesn't seem so easy sometimes, but trust me, it is the only way you can lead to your mission. So in today's video, let's get to know the easy way of forgiveness. But wait, have you subscribed to my channel yet? Do it now. Talking about forgiving others, some people seem to have forgiveness figured out backwards because they think if they won't forgive someone, it's the other person's problem. But the truth is, when we withhold forgiveness, we suffer and no one else in this entire world. And the funny thing is, half of the time, the guilty party doesn't even know what's going on in our creative little head. So they continue to breeze through life while we put ourselves through so much mental anguish. Besides, unforgiveness is one of the greatest causes of sickness because a sore mind creates a sore body. So as long as we hold other people responsible for our happiness, we are refusing to admit our own responsibility. Blaming people never got anyone anywhere. The moment we stop blaming others, we get in a position to take some action to improve things. So note it down, blaming is only an excuse to do absolutely nothing about reality. Now some people say that I will forgive you but I can't forget. What they really mean is, I will forgive you a little bit, but I want to hang on to it just in case it's convenient to remind you about it later on. Real forgiveness is letting go. See, we all live our lives the best way we know how. Of course, we make a lot of mistakes. Nobody opens his eyes the moment he is born and thinks, great, here's my big chance to go out and screw up my life. Funny, isn't it? The point is, blaming gets us nowhere. If something is done, it's done. Ripping about it changes nothing. But how does this relate to changing people? When we do choose to forgive, a miraculous principle comes into action. As we change our attitude towards other people, they too begin to alter their behaviors. Because it is the very, very basic human nature to seek acceptance. People roam around and put immense efforts just to get validated and respected by other people. So when you accept them, they feel respected. And then the another human tendency comes into play which leads them to respect you back. Because what we give is what we get. Your unconditional acceptance will make them happy, which in turn will make them want to please you too. So they subconsciously start to mold according to you so that they can please you. So, accept everything and try to improve things with a relaxed approach because calm efforts produce way better results. So be cool and influence rather than controlling and gripping. I hope this was helpful. Try it out and see it for yourself. Enjoy changing people. And if you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for happy vibes. I'll see you next time. Bye!